सर गुड मॉर्निंग मैम ओके प्लीज बी सीटेड थैंक यू मैम ओके इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ मैम माई नेम इज बिभू प्रसाद सिंह आई बिलोंग टू कटक डिस्ट्रिक्ट I have completed my graduation in agriculture from OUT, okay. and uh, I have completed my post graduation in uh, plant breeding and genetics. That is also from OUT, hmm. and my hobbies are uh, kitchen gardening, hmm. walking, and meditation. Hmm. Okay, what are the subjects you have taken in uh, OPSC? Ma'am, my first optional is agriculture, hmm. and my second optional is botany. Okay. What do you know about the Sri Lankan crisis? Ma'am, in recent times, Sri Lanka is facing a heavy economic crisis. There are uh, several reasons behind it. Particularly, Sri Lanka's Sri Lanka's economy is based on tourism sector. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, it was uh, it was hard hit uh, due to the pandemic. And ma'am, secondly, the Uh, to totally change of the agricultural pattern ma'am uh, from organic uh, from inorganic um, they are using chemical fertilizers they are directly converted into the organic farming uh, these are the two main reasons behind the economic crisis okay and what about the tax concession ma'am that sir. is the major reason of uh, sri lankan crisis and another reason is free bees Provided free by bees. the government. Yes, ma'am. Free bees culture. Okay, you have to take care of that angle also. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Then uh, you have uh, completed your uh, B.Sc. in agriculture. Yes, ma'am. Then why don't you choose agricultural field and you are interested for O.P.Sc. I mean administrative line. You can have better contribution in the field of agriculture uh, culture because our government is. Uh, Stressing on agriculture and uh, agricultural field is the most neglected field in Odisha. Yes, ma'am. Farmers are doing suicide, committing suicide. Ma'am, actually, uh, as you said, it's a very diverse field, ma'am. Uh, agriculture. Uh, ma'am, what I think, uh, what I feel is that I will get uh, more diversified work work culture than from the agriculture sector, and uh, and I will get. Uh, more extended exposure to different uh, organizations different categories of people and uh, ma'am uh, i think uh, it will provide me a good career growth uh, in civil services and mm -hmm. where i can contribute to in the welfare of the society uh, where being professionally satisfied and do something for my society that's why i have chosen uh, civil services over agriculture okay sir <laughs> We process for second time. I'm meeting you here. Yes, sir. I'm going to repeat the old questions and the old pattern of things. Okay. Last uh, we have discussed. I just, as per your uh, information sheet, you are president of student union in College of Agriculture. Yes, sir. Right. Suppose you are uh, chosen as uh, administrative officer and you are posted. Somewhere in a block as a block development officer. Yes, sir. And there, none of your subordinate they are willing to carry out your directions. Yes, sir. They have started agitation. Yeah. What will be your action Dibu. plan? Yes, sir. Sir, first I will uh, try to make them understand about <laughs> the policies. what i what i am really what i really want to uh, do actually about the beneficial effects of the uh, particular plan uh, for the common people and uh, if uh, after that if they don't agree with the uh, with the plan or uh, my action agenda then uh, i will uh, try to um, try to make notice uh, Uh, of these things to my superior sir good enough that you have uh, started uh, i mean uh, initially you wanted to counsel them is a good practice for the administrative officer yes sir 
Yes, sir. I will try to make them understand. Can you tell me what is the difference between a leader and a boss? Sir, a boss is actually um, emphasizes upon the work productivity. Uh, that is the completion of the work done. Nothing, beyond, nothing more than that. But in case of a leader, uh, he or she actually um, tries to um, tries to improve the his, his employees or her employees in a more holistic manner. That is, uh, uh, in terms of his own career growth uh, or other developmental activities. That's it. Are you interested in an internal topic? You must have. Uh, uh, yes, sir. Gathered a lot of information. What is war crime in aspect of Ukraine? Uh, sir, uh, currently the attack of uh, Russia on Ukraine, uh, particularly concerning the joining of the NATO membership, they are uh, doing a lot of heinous criming, crimes, particularly in the areas of Bucha, Bucha area in the Ukraine. Uh, these type of uh, crimes include crimes against women, minor children. Uh, that, sir, uh, I think. Is it only? Only aspect or there is something else uh, in respect of uh, human rights violation? Human rights violence. Yes, yes. sir. Human rights violations. Violations. Uh, Even if there is a war, there are certain parameters. Yes, sir. Certain formalities that to be observed by the countries. Sir, actually... In respect of the life of the civilians. Common people, sir. Uh, Sir, actually, instead of uh, attacking on the army camps or uh, soldiers, they are uh, also attacking upon the common people. Those who are uh, even not aware of the um, particular war or something else. Which areas are uh, badly affected by these war crimes due, during evasion of these Russian defense forces? Can you play? Sir, Donetsk, Donbass, Luhansk, sir. Donetsk, uh, Luhansk and uh, Donbass region, sir. What do you say about the India role in uh, mitigating this uh, war-like situation? Uh, sir, recently in UN, sir, uh, Mexican president also recommended uh, our uh, Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi's uh, interruption uh, for uh, uh, to stop the war, uh, particularly uh, the current Russia and Ukraine crisis, so that uh, that that, he, that will that will having a very good impact upon the international geopolitics. What is the recent uh, say of our security uh, member? India's Security Council permanent member. The recent development. It is of yesterday's news only. Sir, uh, I did not understand, sir. India has taken a stand that the war must stop. The grave war which has been uh, found in Ukraine. Yes, sir. The investigation should be made by independent agency. That is the latter stand okay, sir. of India, which is being appreciated by all Western countries. Okay, sir. What is your opinion about uh, this previous in respect of the Kisans, just prior to the election uh, time, what is the difference between the state freebies and union government freebies? Sir, uh, freebies, uh, particularly before the event of election, the political parties are trying to um, trying to bring more and more people, uh, particularly from the uh, marginal and the small pharma groups, sir, pharma groups. And uh, they are trying to increase their vote bank. Sir, actually, in the long term, uh, by the uh, implementation of the free wish, sir, uh, uh, I feel there, uh, there will be much less uh, improvement in the social sector as compared to welfare schemes, which is having a larger impact upon the society. I wanted to know uh, from you uh, the difference between the union government free wish and state government free wish. Okay, sir. So, if, if, if you can cover with the... Um, okay, okay, sir. Yes. Sir, actually... I wanted to know, but do you have any knowledge about the uh, this Kaliya and Balam, difference between both, both the Yodras? 
काळिया रोजना एंड बल्ला बलराम जोजना यस सर यस सर काळिया रोजना इज फुल फॉर्म इज कृषक असिस्टेंस फॉर लिवलीवुड लिवलीवुड एंड इनकम ऑगमेंटेशन ऑफ द फार्मर्स बलराम रोजना इज basically based upon the availability availability of uh, farm loans that is uh, institutional credit system to the landless or uh, bag chassis sir uh, this is the basic difference between these two systems which area government has not uh, tossed with, within this kali yojana which particular community those who are not beneficiaries of kali yojana sir so, uh, not included not included sorry sir actually i am forgetting about as a student of agriculture you should know about kaliya yojana very well sir i think uh, fishery <laughs> not sure about that sir okay does it include uh, landless people those who do not have any land uh, yes sir sir it includes hmm. small and marginal farmers yes sir landless laborers landless also yes ma'am oh. thank you so much Sir. Last, last, so this is the second attempt. No, sir. Sir, no. actually, I have uh, given my two attempts, past two attempts in my master degree program, and uh, sir, actually, I could not manage the preparation, so I could not uh, qu- qualify the prelims itself. Sir, uh, this is my actually fourth attempt, and last year. Uh, I, last year, second attempt. Thank. That one eighteen is called eighteen, not high level. Sir, eighteen, sir. Yes. 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 Yes.
one ordinary acre, one standard acre is equal to Dana acre ordinary acre provided double crop for single crop to one time irrigation. No irrigation can get Tini acre is equal to one standard acre. No irrigation. No irrigation. No irrigation. Yes. Totally erected with it. Okay. It, 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 it is a basic question of uh, expected from any person in our team. Yes. Sir, it is a Sir, uh, sir, 2000, 
खराब सब स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ माय बैच हैव ऑलरेडी आंसर्ड इन ओडिया थैंक यू मैम